weg. Seid ihr fröhlich? Ja. Do you feel happy every day? Fühlt ihr euch jeden Tag glücklich? Yes. Yes. <laughs> no. Okay. Raise your hand if sometimes you feel cranky. Hebt deine Hand, wenn du manchmal so zornig, zornig bist. No. Okay, raise your hand if you're feeling cranky right now. Okay, one, two, three, yeah. Raise your hand if you're feeling cranky, but you didn't want to raise your hand and let anyone know. And you want to keep who close our eyes? So, what do you do if you're feeling cranky? Was machst du, wenn du frustriert bist? It's a question you have to answer. Do you? She will withdraw. You withdraw. You hide. You hide yourself. Get a blanket like this and go. Yeah, that's what you do. Okay, what do you do? Do you whine? Bishma 
And just like you, Yudhisthira Maharaj was sitting completely still and listening with full attention, just like you. So, genau so toll wie ihr das macht. Power of suggestion. Ganz ruhig, ja, ja, also. So wie ihr auch ruhig da sitzt, ganz aufmerksam zuhört, wie ihr das so super macht, so hat es auch der Yudhisthira Maharaj gemacht. So, once upon a time, there was a young Brahmin boy. Eins. And he studied the Vedas. He was quite learned. And he used to do yagyas like this. And one day he was walking on the street. At that time, there was a wealthy businessman. And he had a big golden chariot. Yes. <laughs> it was a Lamborghini actually. <laughs> and he was intoxicated. And he was just enjoying so much. That he was speeding, he was driving over the speed limit. You know like sometimes you're in the car with your mother, and she's taking you somewhere. And you look over her shoulder in the clock. <laughs> so then you complain, oh please don't go so fast. <laughs> so he was going too fast over the speed limit. And he came, he was going around the road and instead of being careful he was very careless and he knocked over that young Brahmin boy. And he didn't even stop it. He just sped away. So then that young person, he, he wasn't really badly injured but he had some bruises but the main thing that was bruised was his ego. His pride. So the the young man was not really physically hurt. He had some bruises, but most of the time it was his pride that hurt him. Because he was very poor. He was very poor. And he didn't have a Lamborghini or a BMW. And he had no Lamborghini and no Mercedes. So he was lying on the ground. And he was lying on the ground. And he was in pain. Oh. Oh, the class and the pain. And he was thinking, I should just. Give up my life. What's the use of living? Because I am very poor. And I don't have the fancy things like that person who knocked me down. And just as he was moaning and complaining, oh, what's the use of living, being a poor Brahmin? This is a terrible life. Do you sometimes think things things are terrible? Think so much as life is just for fun. Ah, it's so terrible. It's so shrekly. Do you ever think like that? Think so much, man. Yeah, sometimes. So he was thinking exactly like that. You thought it. But then something happened. I'm sure. That probably hasn't happened to you. Yes. Also, pretty sure. There was a jacko jump in Sanskrit school jambuka. Ah, there came a shakal and jambu. You know, shakal. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
because there are many, many animals. And all these animals, they wish that they could be a human being like you. Especially, you know, you have ten fingers and ten toes. It's amazing. Who's got ten fingers? Show me. So, all of them, wriggle them around. Uh, huh? Who's got ten toes? Show me. Wriggle them. Very good, she's doing very well. Look. Everyone try to wriggle like her. So I wish that my life were a success like your life. Because you have ten fingers. I'd be so happy if I had ten fingers. <laughs> He said, My dear Brahman, when you are cold, you human beings who have ten fingers, you can make some clothing and wear nice clothes. But we animals who have no fingers, we cannot make a nice warm clothing for us when it's very cold. And when it gets really cold, then we need a shelter. And you human beings are so lucky. Using your ten fingers, you can make a tent. Or you, you can even build a house. But I only have the jackal paws and I cannot make anything. So I have to stay outside in the cold. So, if I were like you, I would be so happy. Are you happy? Next time you're not feeling happy, just look and count your fingers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, amazing. <laughs> Everything is good. <laughs> Then the jackal said, but even though I don't have ten fingers, Still, I feel quite happy. Because at least I'm not like the other, the other creatures lower than me, like worms. They don't even have legs that so they can run away. And the birds come and just and eat them like spaghetti. <laughs> But at least I have arms, I have legs, and I can run around. So I am quite happy, but I'm not such a great success like you. So that brother, he was amazed. He thought, a talking jackal. <laughs> ah, not only a talking jackal, but what is he talking? Such great wisdom. The jackal said to him, Why are you complaining? 
that you don't have enough things in your life. You should know that happiness doesn't depend on things in your life. It is a, it's a state of mind. You are wishing, oh, I wish I were dead, but this is only caused by greediness. But by being greedy, you never become more happy. If a person is poor, they think, I wish I had lots of money. But greed is insatiable. Never satisfied. And when that person becomes wealthy, he thinks, I wish I were the king. And if a person by chance actually becomes the king of the whole world, then he thinks this world is not so good. I want to go to heaven and become a David, a demigod. And then, if he does sacrifices and goes to heaven and becomes a demigod, then he's looking around, he sees Indra, I wish I were that the king, Indra, the king of heaven. Macht er vielleicht so Opferzeremonien, wird zu den himmlischen Planeten erhoben und dann gefällt es ihm da eine Weile, weil dann denkt er, ach, da gibt es ja den König der Halbgötter, den Indra, ach, wenn ich doch bloß der wäre. So this greed, it never ends, it just goes on and on and you never feel happiness. So diese Gier hört nie auf und du wirst nie glücklich. It's better to be satisfied with what you have. Es ist viel schlauer und besser. To be very grateful and give thanks to Krishna. Dankbar zu sein und Krishna zu danken. Because all things in this world are temporary. Denn alle Dinge in dieser Welt sind. But our loving relationship with Krishna is forever. Aber unsere liebevolle Beziehung zu Krishna ist für immer. Then that Jacob became very philosophical. Dann wurde dieser Schakal sehr I can see you have two heads. I can see you. Hey you. Leon. You have two heads. You have two heads. Point, point to your head. Zeig mal auf deinen Kopf. Zeig mal. Can you point to your head? Zeig mal zu deinem Kopf. Okay, you can keep that one, but the other one I'm going to cut it off. Okay, den kannst du behalten, aber den anderen Kopf die Steine weg. Okay. Ist das okay? No. So you have two heads. Also hast du zwei Köpfe, denn du möchtest nicht, dass wir den anderen abschneiden. Wir lassen ja den, den du gerade angefangen hast. Ja. Okay, that's what he said. Never work with children and animals. Okay, we should have rehearsed this before. When I say, do you have two heads, you're supposed to say, no. Wir machen das jetzt nochmal. Ich sag, wenn ich dich frage, hast du zwei Köpfe, dann sagst du. Do you? Okay, I'll try that. What about you? Hello. Shanti. 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 How many hands do you have? Two or three? Two or three? Two. Two. Okay, you can keep those two hands, but your third hand I'm going to cut it off. Okay, you can keep the two hands, but your third hand is going to cut it off. Is that okay? Is that okay? Is that okay? Yes, you agree, right? Well, yeah, yeah, but what about you if I cut off your third hand? No? <laughs> so, the point here is that no one, well, the Shastra is usually correct, but the Shastra says that no one is afraid of having their second head surgically removed. <laughs> No one is afraid of having their third hand removed. Why? Because they never knew that they have anything another hand or another head. So you cannot have fear about things that you don't know. So the jackal said that if there's something in this world that you don't have, you don't have. So the Shakana, when there are things in this world that you don't have, and you've never experienced it, you have never experienced it. 
then you cannot be afraid of losing it. <laughs> right? <laughs> you will not be afraid of losing it. And if there's something that you don't even know about, you cannot even want it. Und wenn es etwas gibt, von dem du noch gar noch nie gehört hast und gar nichts davon weißt, dann kannst du es noch nicht mal haben wollen. If you don't experience something, then you will not desire it. Wenn du etwas nicht erfahren hast, dann bist, kannst du es auch nicht. Because all desires are coming from the past experience. Denn alle Wünsche kommen durch vorangegangene yeah. Erfahrungen. Do you want ice cream? Möchtest du ice cream? No. Oh. <laughs> okay, we'll do, that. do you want ice cream? Yes, yes. Why? Because you had ice cream before. Hast du schon mal ice cream? Did you have ice cream ever before? Yes, and that's why you want it again. Deswegen ist es wieder. So the jackal told him, you are so lucky that you did not experience all the pleasures of this wealthy man. So then, it will not come into your mind. I wish I had caviar. Du hast das Glück, dass du nicht all diese Dinge erfahren hast wie dieser reiche Mann. Deswegen kannst du die gar nicht wünschen. Du kannst zum Beispiel gar nicht wünschen, oh, ich hätte so gerne Kaviar. Das sind irgendwelche Fischeier. Fischeier. Teure Fischeier. You know, there was a king. He was so powerful. He used to play chess. Er hat Schach gespielt. Do you know how to play chess? Kannst du Schach spielen? No, it's like checkers. Yeah, you know. Ah, yeah. You play chess? Do you have some chess pieces? Hast du solche Schachfiguren? Ja, bei meinem Opa. And they are with his grandfather. Mm -hmm. Okay, so there was one king. He was so powerful. He used to play chess, but with human pieces. He had a big chess board, and someone has to dress up as the king and the queen and the knight and the rook and stand there, and then he tells them where to move, and they walk on the squares and stand there until his next move. So yeah. dieser König war so mächtig, dass er hatte ein, äh, ein riesiges Schachbrett. Äh, das war so groß, dass da Menschen drauf stehen konnten. Da mussten auch die Leute drauf stehen. Und der eine war zum Beispiel als König verteilt, der andere als die Könige, andere als Läufer, andere als Pferd und so weiter. Wow. So, you see, you will never think, oh, what shall I do today? Let me play chess with human pieces. Und du hast noch nie daran gedacht, na, was mache ich heute? Ja, lass mich doch mit Menschen jetzt äh, Schach, mit menschlichen Figuren Schach spielen. Because you never experienced it. Denn du hast es noch nie gemacht. Ich weiß nicht, komm, noch mal etwas nachhören. Because you never experienced it, so then you don't want it. Du hast es noch nie gesehen, noch nie erfahren, und deswegen hast du das auch nicht gewollt, dass du mit. So in the same way, the Jambuka said, in there is. A very delicious type of bird called the Latwak. Would you like a Latwak? Kentucky Fried Latwak? <laughs> no? Ah. But anyone who has tasted the Latwak, then they want it again and again. So the Jacob said, You're so lucky! That Look at all the things that you don't have, it's amazing. <laughs> so, because usually people are looking, oh, I don't have enough things. But we have to change our idea. Look at all the things that I don't have, which are not entangling me in the worldly desires. How fortunate I am to be completely broke. <laughs> Sichtweise ändern und mal darauf schauen, wow, nicht, nicht uns zu ärgern, was wir nicht haben, sondern zu sagen, wow, es gibt so viele Sachen, die ich nicht habe, das heißt, ich kann auch nicht darüber frustriert sein, dass die verloren gehen und äh, so viele Sachen, über die ich mich nicht ärgern brauche, weil ich habe sie gar nicht. Ich muss sie auch nicht pflegen, ich muss kein großes Auto pflegen. I don't have to take care of them. Yes, yes. So then, the Jabuk said, my dear, his name was Kashyap, the brother. Kasyap, you are so lucky, you are so fortunate, your life is a great success. Dieser Schakal sagte zu dem Brahman, der hieß Kasyap, du hast so ein Glück, dein Leben ist ein großer Erfolg. So then, that Jambuka, he wanted to share a little personal biographical information. So dieser Schakal wollte jetzt mit ihm, mit dem jungen Brahman, eine persönliche Geschichte teilen. 
He said, I would be very lucky if I were a human being like you. <coughs> But now, I am in this position, because actually I... I would feel lieber Mensch sein. He said, I used to be a human being just like you. <laughs> But I squandered the good opportunity. I was very proud and arrogant. I especially thought that I knew everything. I thought, who can teach me anything? I am the most intelligent one. And I did not respect the Brahmanas. And especially, I did not believe in the Vedas. Who, raise your hand if you have heard of Bhagavad Gita. Bhagavad Gita? Yes, that's Krishna's own the explanation of life. That is Krishna's own explanation of life. So he said, in my last life, I never believed in the Bhagavad Gita. In my last life, I have never believed in the Bhagavad Gita. Or any Vedic literature. Or any Vedic literature. I always try to argue with everyone. Immer mit jedem versucht zu streiten. I only believed in what I could see with my own eyes. And in this way, I criticized the people who had faith in Krishna. And now look what happened to me. I am a Jambuka. So it's important to understand that everything in the Vedas, everything in the Bhagavad Gita is 100% true. Es ist wichtig zu verstehen, dass alles, was in den heiligen Schriften steht, in, der, in den Veden und der Bhagavad Gita, ist hundertprozentig richtig. Yes, and if you don't believe it, wenn es nicht glaubt, and if you depend on your own intelligence, wenn du dich auf den Erbsenkern verlässt, then in your next life you can be a Jambuka. In deinem nächsten Leben kannst du ein Schakal werden. And then you won't even have ten fingers. It's terrible. Und dann willst du nicht mal zehn Finger haben. Furchtbar. Look at all the good things you can do with ten fingers. You can play the harmonium. Harmonium spielen. You can pick your nose. No, don't do that. No, 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 no. Open. So it's very good to have ten fingers. Always be happy. Don't complain. And have a strong trust in the Krishna's words in Bhagavad Gita. Okay, understand? Yeah, Very good. So then, that Brahmin boy Kashyap, he lifted himself up and dusted himself off. And now he had new inspiration in his life. He began to look at himself and think, actually, I'm very fortunate. Wow, was hab ich für ein Glück. Everything is wonderful. Alles ist super. And my life is the fine. Mein Leben ist schön. And then he said to the Jambuka, you are really a very wise person. Und er sagte zu dem Shaka, Mensch, du bist echt ein Schlauer. Thank you for your kind instructions that have picked me up out of my suffering condition. Ich danke dir für deine guten Unterweisungen. Die mich herausgeholt haben aus meinem Leid. And there and then, in front of his eyes, that little Jambuka that was being eaten by mosquitoes and worms, he suddenly <lacht> manifested his true form as Lord Indra, the King of Heaven. Oh, und dann, plötzlich vor seinen Augen, verwandelte sich dieser Schakal, der vorher noch von, von Zecken und allen möglichen gebissen worden war, in eine wundervolle, große Gestalt, der König des Himmels, nämlich Indra. So, this is a very good story to remember every day when you're feeling cranky and complaining. Das ist eine gute Geschichte, an die man sich äh, erinnern kann, wenn, wenn man unzufrieden ist und frustriert. And also to inspire us to always believe in the Vedas and Bhagavad Gita. Und uns zu inspirieren, immer an die Veden und die Bhagavad Gita zu glauben. Do you know what the Vedas say? Wisst ihr, was die Veden sagen? 
So all the great sages who have divine realization, they know that the name Krishna and Krishna himself is are exactly the same. Die großen, großen Weisen, die haben das erfahren und verstanden, dass, dass der Name Krishna und Krishna selber nicht voneinander verschieden sind. Except the name of Krishna is more merciful than Krishna. Nur dass der Name Krishna noch barmherziger ist als Krishna. So this was proven once. Das wurde eins bewiesen. It happened that some demigods they were quarreling with each other. Eines Tages geschah es, dass die Halbgötter verstritten waren. Who is the best? Wer ist der Beste hier? Is Indra the best? Ist Indra der König des Himmels? Is Ganesh the best? Ist Ganesh der Beste der da hinten? Is Shiva the best? Is Shiva der Größte und Beste? Is Kartikeya the best? Kartikeya der Beste. They were all quarreling. Sie haben sich gestritten. So then Narad Muni came. Kam der Narada Muni, mm -hmm. der Weise. And Narada Muni said, all right, I'll organize a competition and we'll find out who is the best. Okay, er sagte, kein Problem, wir machen jetzt einen Wettbewerb und da finden wir heraus, mm -hmm. wer der Beste ist. Have you ever been in a race? Ach, hast du schon mal Wettlauf gemacht? Running, Running race. race. Wettlauf? Ja, yeah. mach ich immer mit deiner yeah. Schwester und im Kindergarten. Ich kann ja. immer. Ja. Ah. Sonst war immer yeah. Have you, have you auch been, been in a race? Er hat auch Wettlauf gemacht. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Where did, what medal did you get? Bronze, silver or gold? No medal, no gold. He was also in a, in a race. I also. Did you run as well? Ah, good. So Narayani said, all of you Davidas should have a race. Okay, you should have a race. And then we'll find out who's the best. Then find the house. It should be a race three times around the whole universe. And whoever goes three times around the whole universe in the fastest time is the winner. So Narad Muni, he made a line and said, everyone come to the line. Ready, steady. So they came there. No, wait, 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 not yet. So they came there on their um, carriers. You know that Lord Shiva came on his bull. Die haben nämlich alle solche keine Autos, sondern Träger. Und Lord Shiva, der hat einen wundervollen Stier. So he was there on the starting line with his bull, getting ready, steady. Und der war da, stand da an dieser Startlinie, war bereit. Und hey, auf die Plätze, fertig. And what does Indra ride? Und was reitet Indra? Elephant. Elephant. Yes. Here is a planet of the Vedas. Indra rides an elephant. So he came on his big white elephant named Airavata. And he was on and he was ready, steady. And Kartikeya, he's the god of war. He came and what does he ride? 
Do you know? Take care, come. The finger pickle. Yes! Wow! wow. Incredible! Yes! yes. He rides on a peacock, so he can. Ready, steady. And then you see our friend over there, Ganesh. Ganapati Ganesh. Yeah. Ganesh. Yes, he came. But who is the friend of Ganesh? Yes, the friend of Ganesh. A mouse. Yes. Well then, not to be out there. You scored a goal for the team. Well done. Don't want the boys team to be embarrassed. Uh, Always Jungs, getting defeated by the ghost. The, the Jungs were zwar besiegt von den Mädchen, aber müssen sich nicht. So then Ganesh came on his mouse. Ganesh came on his mouse. And he got on the mouse, ready, steady, and the mouse collapsed. Because Ganesh, look at Ganesh's belly. Yes, that's what happens when you eat too much ice cream. <laughs> so the mouse, the mouse of Ganesh, even he couldn't get to ready, steady, go, only ready, steady. <laughs> and then Narakuni said, go, and all the other neighbors, they all sped off, leaving poor Ganesh there in the dust. <laughs> Los! Rasten sie auf ihren jeweils ihrem Pfau und auf ihren äh, Elefanten und ja, Stieren und was sie immer hatten. Los! Super schnell! Und äh, der arme Ganesh blieb einfach da an der Ziellinie noch stehen und äh, nur, pff, den Staub abgekriegt. Ja. And all the devotees were going at very high speed. So 
Sobre que dice, no, no, that's not my plan. He said, okay, okay. So you want me to become strong so I can carry you? That's going to take forever. Ah. So that guy said, no, I have another plan. Do you have a plan? What's your plan? He says that. So this was Ganesh's idea. It was a brilliant idea. Really, really intelligent. Only the most intelligent person could come up with such a brilliant idea. Yajanti he made us up. Those who have good intelligence, they know that Krishna and the holy name are same. So then Ganesh, he took a piece of paper and he wrote Hare Krishna on the paper. And he put it down on the ground. And then he told his rats, come on, let's do Parakrama. So then they walked around that piece of paper three times. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna. And in the meantime, then all the demigods are going mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. like this, and they were just coming to the finishing line on the third lap. So, Lord Brahma was in the race. What was Brahma driving? It wasn't clear who was going to win. So just as they were getting close to the finishing line, then the elephant of Indra stuck out his nose. His trunk. Because in a race, you know when there's a photo finish, click. They do a click as if they're going over the line. You can find out whose nose went over the line first. Yeah, yeah. It's been tatsächlich so gemacht bei solchen Olympia-Rennen. Wenn mit einem Foto gemacht, nehmen wir, wo die an Ziellinie kommen. Und dann guckt man, wenn einer zum Beispiel die Nasenspitze ein bisschen vorn hat, dann hat der gewonnen gegen den anderen, der die Nasenspitze vorn hat. Yeah. So if you have a big nose, don't complain. Because if you're in the Olympics, it will give you an advantage. So the elephant of Indra stuck out his nose. But Brahma was riding a swan and the swan has a long neck so the swan stuck out his head also. Because his, his nose is not so big but he has a very long neck. <laughs> yeah, exactly like that. Yeah, were you there? Did you see it? How did you know it was just like that? So then they crossed the line and Brahmaji was saying, I am the winner, I am the winner. And then they crossed the line and Brahmaji was saying, I am the winner. 
Krishna.